G'day and welcome to Wine Week. I'm Danny. And I'm Brad. And this week I'm going to kick off with the Rolf Binder Heinrich. Now, this one, it's got a German sounding name, comes from the Brosser, but it is a classic French Rhone style blend, this one. Uh, the uh, the big ones, the Shiraz, the uh, Grenache, the Mataro, as these guys call it, Maverdra, depending on who you speak to. Same deal, same beautiful finish on these wines. Now, I keep bringing these up each week on Wine Week because basically I think they're a great wine. They're great, soft, easy to drink wines straight out of the bottle. They don't need 10 years before you can uh, attack them. And look, they are a perfect accompaniment to food. Uh, case in point, this weekend is the uh, the first weekend of the Australian Rules football down here, down under. And look, if you wanted to put something together with a meat pie and some sauce, it really is a great idea. Give this a go. Have a look for it. Grab your 4 and 20 and hook in and uh, enjoy some football. This one comes in at around about the $25 mark, the 2004. Look out for it. A great wine. Yeah, a really good Barossa blend there, so look out for it. I'm going to have a look this week at the uh, Water Wheel Bendigo Shiraz. This is a 2005 vintage. But one of the things about these guys is their remarkable consistency. They turn out this Shiraz every year and it is always a ripper. And the great thing is they haven't increased their prices either. As they get better reviews, they've still kept it very affordable. You can actually pick this up on discount around the $15 mark at a lot of bottle shops. Recommend it retails around $20. It would still be good value. We would still recommend it at $20. But if you can pick it up for $15, it's fantastic. It's quite a big Shiraz. It's from Bendigo, which is starting to get a real uh, name for itself for its Shiraz. It's not too far from Heathcote, and we all know how good the uh, Heathcote Shiraz are that are coming out at the moment. So this one's 2005. It's quite rich. Uh, really good drinking right now. So, you know, probably age well for the next few years, but you could certainly drink it right now as well. So it's the uh, Water Wheel Bendigo Shiraz, a fantastic little wine. Yeah, great wine, and yeah, look at $15, you can afford to age some of them for a couple of years. Definitely get some of those into your cellar. Look, the last one we're going to have a look at this week is the Grosset Semillon Sauvignon Blanc. Uh, look, the guys at Grosset are probably best known for their Polish Hill Riesling, but hey, each week we've been prattling on about how good Rieslings are. We thought we might look at something a little bit different this week. This Samsef Blanc is great, it really is. It comes in at a little under the $30 mark, so it's not the cheapest wine, but it is a very, very good version of it. it you know, there are very few Semillon Sauvignon Blancs out there that are going to compete with this fellow. Um, great acid sort of finish, nice and light, those classic citrus sort of flavours that you're used to. But look, if you wanted to do something a bit interesting with this, hook down to your local Vietnamese restaurant, pick up some uh, Sang Choi Bao, Throw it together, you're going to have a great start to an evening with that one. Jeffrey Grosset, a big fan of the uh, screw cap finishes on these ones. One of the guys in Australia that really got that moving, and look, we can only say thumbs up to that because it means that just about every one of these wines you'll pick up will be as fresh as a daisy when you get into it. Yeah, and it's a really good one to look at because there are a lot of cheap Semsav Blanc blends around, but this one is a premium. So if you really want to see how it's done well with some really good fruit and good winemaking, this one's your... This one's the one to go for. Yeah, definitely. So, look, this week we've looked at the uh, the Rolf Binder Rhone Blend Heinrich. The uh, Water Wheel Bendigo Shiraz. Yeah, and of course the Grosset Semillon Sauvignon Blanc. So, thanks for joining us on Wine Week. We'll see you again next week. See you next week.